What's up? Hey, what's up? So the internet has no shortage of pictures that make you say what the fuck, and today I'm gonna go through some that I found on the internet and said what the fuck to. So here they are. First, let's start with this ecstatically creepy goth dude playing with a hula hoop. I've never seen a goth dude so creepy and happy all at the same time. It's like he was all goth and depressed and then he discovered the hula hoop and now he's just so goddamn happy. The next day he was probably wearing pink and purple and skipping down the street. Here's a woman that was too lazy to put clothing on. She went to the store wrapped in a blanket. Maybe she's doing a walk of shame. Maybe she woke up in a strange man's house and she has no idea where she is. My guess is that she's just lazy and crazy though. Here's a girl wearing a hamster as a spacer. That's a little disturbing. I guess the next step would be to put a guinea pig in there. Then put a bunny in there. Then maybe a cat. Then upgrade to a dog. Yeah, I want to see her with a dog in her ear. Might be animal cruelty, but that would be impressive. Here's a dude wearing a koala stuffed animal on his face. <laughs> what the fuck? That is creepy as fuck. He shoved his head up the ass of a stuffed koala. And he's wearing it as a mask. I'm pretty sure this picture's been around for a while, but it is still creepy as fuck. How about this grandmother and her baby monkey? Grandma's getting crunk. It's so cute and tiny until it starts flinging its shit at your face. And if that's your baby monkey, Grandma, don't be smoking around the baby monkey, okay? That's not good for it. Don't be giving that little baby monkey some secondhand smoke. That's not healthy. That's not nice to do to the monkey. That's your baby. And here's a woman dying in a jello pit. Is that jello or did she splatter when he landed on top of her? She looks happy, but I don't understand how you're just like laughing and smiling while this dude is crushing your pelvis. I think it's safe to say that he won the jello match. This one is fucking weird. This guy's just standing there like spear fishing while this leather Power Ranger calls him out on a big wheel. He's like, I challenge you to a big wheel race around the river. That is a serious big wheel rider. I used to love big wheels when I was a kid. I would kill to get back on one of those and not look like a weird dude riding a big wheel. I'd get on that shit and just ride it down a hill and everyone would be like, who did he steal that from? Here's a book you can buy your child. Judy can gut the zombie. Now you gut the zombie. It's a sensory book for children teaching you how to kill a zombie. This is the zombie survival guide for children. I actually really like this one. I would buy this book if I knew where it was and then never give it to my child. You give this book to your child and then the next day they're killing the family pet. The book told me to do it. And then there's this really fucked up search history. Am I the only one who likes Joffrey? Am I the only one who doesn't like Doctor Who? Am I the only one who doesn't care about the World Cup? Am I the only one that eats their own poo because it tastes like lemon? You'd like to say yes, you're the only person who eats your own poo because it tastes like lemon. But then you see that it's in the search history so it's been there enough that enough people have asked about it, like, I eat my own shit because it tastes like lemon. I don't even buy lemons anymore. I just squeeze my shit on top of shrimp. I can't confirm or deny that shit tastes like lemon, but that would be really weird. I don't eat my own shit, so I'm, and I'm not gonna try it. I'm not gonna shove shit in my mouth and be like, they got me. It doesn't taste like lemon. It doesn't taste like lemon. I will let that be a mystery. Some things need to be a mystery, and eating shit is one of those things in my book. I think I'm more offended by the people who don't like Doctor Who and don't like Game of Thrones. What the fuck? So, thanks for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed the what the fuck pictures that I shared with you today. If you really enjoyed the video, hit the like button down below. If you have any ideas for new videos, let me know what you want to see. I'm always open to suggestions. If you really enjoy me and my comedy and everything that I'm about, then hit the subscribe button up top and you will see much more content coming soon. And I will see you guys again really soon.